Hello friends, so today we are going to see how we, we can use the PowerShell script to uh, join multiple computer into the domain, okay? So the basic need uh, we have is uh, we, like uh, the IP address should be configured on the computer and if you are uh, like trying to use the computer name then uh, uh, the name should be resolved, okay? From the computer you are running the script. So your DNS entry uh, should be there when you are using the computer name. So what we are going to do here so uh, let me show you my environment so this is the ad computer from which i'm running the script because this is the lab computer and again i have a two client uh, one uh, with uh, this ip and let me show you the host name also okay and you can see here the it is in the work group okay and again i have the another computer second one and it is uh, the ip address is uh, 22 and it is also not in the domain you can see the computer name mom cl02 and it is in the work group so let's understand the script now so here we have a computer's variable and it will get a content from this text file okay so let me open the text file for you okay live pieces and you can see i have used the ip address over here 100 0, 0, 21 and 22 so you can add as many as computer ips here you you want and if you are adding the computer name then you have to make sure it resolved to the ip address right the dns entry should be there for this computer then only you can use the computer name otherwise it will fail so once this prerequisite is done you can you are ready to go with the to run this script okay so here we are using the add hyphen computer which is the powershell command to join the computer to the domain earlier uh, there was a net dom command also but uh, I, for that you have to use the remote server administration tool on the client computer then only it will be able to do that so uh, powershell it is easily available uh, command so we are using add hyphen computer then computer name so we are giving the computer names from this one right and then we are using the local credential to connect to this servers okay so whatever the computers are here in the live pc so it will try like uh, this command will try to uh, get the local credential for that and we have specified here the local host slash administrator okay because uh, like it's not a domain right we can give the one and we don't know how many computers name will be there how many ip address so local host is the simplest method to use the give the credential like this so use the local host so it will try to uh, check this account on the local machine so whatever the local machine is here it will try to check this account and you can specify here your uh, local account local admin account okay which will be able to help this com this command to connect to your computer then hyphen domain we are specifying the domain here i have a text uh, like the vmware.com as a text domain and then after once this command is done it will restart the computer okay so let's see this computer is powered on this computer is powered on okay so let me run the script now okay when i run the script it will ask me the local credential okay now i'll type the local credential you have to make sure whatever the credential you are using it is same on all the local computer like workstation yeah so i entered the password now i have to give the domain account credential okay so i'll give here the domain credential which have the administrator or the rights to join the computer into the domain you have to use that account so i'm giving the password here so let's wait for some time and we'll see if it'll work okay okay the script has been executed uh, now we'll go here see computer uh, one is also running and the computer two is also running so let it power on and then we can see uh, whether we are able to log in through the uh, domain account or not okay here yeah, the computer is started okay and we'll click on the other user here and we'll put see you can see here sign into the vmware because our computer is added to the domain so we'll type here vmware slash administrator and we'll type the password uh, see uh, we are able to log into that we can see here uh, computer name and uh, you can see see mom hyphen cl01 and uh, join to the domain vmware.com so let's log into the second computer yeah it's already logged in
okay so mom hyphen cl2 is also joined to the domain so that's it for this session uh, thank you for watching the video if you have any doubts uh, you can just put the put into the comment box thank you for watching the video